Mtakunje. Duti ni duke. Duke une mpetu. Une ngoko kwani. The voice of a disgruntled resident after receiving her parcel. She and many others say the groceries were meant to bring relief, but have instead brought misery. We would like to advise the government that he or she must go to the service provider and tell him or her that we are no longer interested in those food parcels. He or her must take the food parcels into her dogs and her children. We are no longer in need of them. All we want is the vouchers so that we could, we could buy food on our own. The government has acknowledged the problem and has committed to fixing it. The cost to government for each food parcel is 1,200, which includes storage, transportation, packaging, labor costs, security, administrative costs, and the actual cost of the contents of the food parcels. Sasa is considering other options in terms of the provisioning of SRT for the future. But little consolation for those in possession of the contaminated food. With no timeline as to when the food will be replaced, the executive mayor of Mnuma Local Municipality, Councillor Netezo, has since extended his sincerest apologies to the broader community of Mnuma and all those who have been affected by this unfortunate incident. Uh, we reported the matter immediately. It was we were alerted, and we then escalated the complaints to the. Uh, relevant department because we thought that uh, we did not want to put the lives of our people at risk through these food parcels. Sasa says it is considering a plea by residents for electronic food vouchers. Ah, Tule Joga, SABC News, 